Hi and welcome to American Printer TV. I'm Tamara Ferlansky. And I'm John Hamilton. Graph Expo 2010 is just around the corner. And on today's show, we will tell you how you can get a virtual preview of the show. And here's what else is coming up. Quad Graphics rings in a new era. DPI expands marketing capabilities. And big changes for the Pittman Company. If you can't wait for Graph Expo 2010 in Chicago, take note. Attendee registration for the free online preview is now open. Sponsored by American Printer Magazine, the August 19th virtual preview features an interactive tour of new equipment and products that will be at the show in October as well as education and live networking opportunities. The event also includes a preview of the Executive Outlook conferences, must see and positively print candidates. All content from Graph Expo 2010, a virtual preview, including the educational presentations, will be archived and available until the start of the show on October 3rd. And you can register at graphexpo.com slash virtual preview. Following its completion of the World Color Acquisition, Quad Graphics is entering a new era as a publicly traded company. Company Chairman, President and CEO Joel Quadracci led his family members and Quad Graphics leaders in ringing the opening bell on July 7th at the New York Stock Exchange. Take a look. The new quad offers a broader variety of products, an enhanced manufacturing platform, and an expanded geographic footprint. It has approximately 28,000 employees in more than 80 facilities in North America, Latin America, and Europe. Visit the company online at www.qg.com. We invite you to join us on August 4th for a free and very timely webinar. Times have never been tougher for quick and small commercial printers. Competition is fierce and margins are thin. But there's money to be made in the mailing business, especially when you consider that much of what you're already printing is destined for the mailbox. On August 4th, we'll present Maximizing Profits, What Every Small Commercial Printer Should Know, a free webinar sponsored by Pitney Bowes. Mailwright Steve Oaks and Pitney Bowes Chris Giles will discuss how to tap into mailing services to gain a competitive edge, improve open rates, and retain customers. To sign up, click on the registration button to the right of your screen. Agfa Graphics has signed an agreement to purchase the assets of Totowa, New Jersey-based Harold M. Pittman Company, a leading U.S. supplier of pre-press, industrial inkjet, press room and packaging printing products and systems. Pittman is Agfa's primary U.S. distributor. Agfa Graphics President Stefan Van Horn says the acquisition will provide Agfa with promising growth opportunities in this strategically important region, adding one of the main drivers behind this decision was the fact that we gain a unique opportunity to significantly grow our inkjet business. Kodak recently terminated Pittman Company's right to distribute its products effective October 5, 2010. Kodak has named Ohio-based Expedex as its primary U.S. reseller for commercial pre-press products. In response to growing demand for high-impact personalized marketing materials, Georgia print service provider Digital Printing and Imaging, or DPI, has installed an HP Indigo 7000 digital press. With a speed of 124 color letter size pages per minute, DPI's new HP Indigo 7000 operates at nearly twice the speed of the 5000 model press. The 7000 provides extra throughput and capacity as the company secures more business from local firms with the same marketing needs as DPI's national clients. You can read the full story as always on AmericanPrinter.com slash news. Well, that does it for this edition of American Printer TV. Let us know your thoughts on our stories by commenting below. We always look forward to hearing from you and what you have to say. Keep on having a great summer. And we will see you next time.